everyone this is mr informal giving you a video a video of my filson collection filson is basically an outdoorsman company who caters to us uh, outdoorsmen whether it be uh, jackets apparel luggages bags but certainly they are famous for their bags especially durable bags and so this video is basically showing you my filson uh, collection and they happen to be accessories and bags so you know what i'm not gonna go through uh, a long intro and just let's get to it so first and foremost i bought these on sale these are the filson tool tray these are pretty nice so they are uh, tray uh, valet tray travelers tray they're pretty cool they were on sale a long time ago for ten dollars and i bought all four of them as you can tell this one is on the tan this one is in the navy black right here hopefully you can see that and then here is the green so again this is the tool tray which is pretty cool and so i'm just gonna throw them on the side right there and let's get to the next bag let's get to the next item this one is the tote bag this is the zippered tote bag right here as you can tell there's that beefy zippers right here inside there's no pocket right there and then outside is just exterior pocket exterior pocket right here and then there should be a key leash right here on the other side and then on the side you could also put water bottles and all of that and this is comes in the otter green i bought this all the way back in 2012 as you can tell that deep green is uh, disappearing again let's put it on the side and then one of my favorite right here is the rucksack which is pretty cool in otter green bought this in 2012 Back when they were actually cheaper you can see the letter right there hopefully you can see that it's degrading you can got pockets very beefy right here and then on the back you got the zipper I mean on the uh, exterior back pocket right here here is your shoulder strap now I wish they had a uh, uh, additional shoulder strap just like the briefcase that comes with it so the weight can even be spread around the shoulders but but at the same time this doesn't dig in i only use this in the summer because in the winter it does sags on the it does sag on the back which i'm not a fan of and then on the inside it's just a regular rucksack no organ no interior pockets or organization and as you can tell it's been used i probably use this once a year it could be two months a month depending on how i feel so that's the rucksack in otter green moving on is the rucksack in desert tan so this is basically the same as the green as you can tell no exterior no interior pockets, just two exter uh, exterior pockets right here, deep ones, which is pretty cool. And then here's the thing, if I shake this, you can hear that zippers, the zipper pull, and also your leather strap. And again, the thing about it is if you wear this with jeans, the jeans will actually stain this. These, this is all from the blue jeans right here. And as you can tell, some rips right here. You can tell that's been used up. And that's the rucksack in uh, Desert Tan, which is pretty cool. And then this is something that you don't normally see, is the medium travel bag in the Navy. And this is when the Navy was actually soft. They say it's 20 22 ounce, but I doubt it. But it's not as a uh, very stiff twill. The rugged tool that I'm normally accustomed to. This is very supple. So with the medium travel bag or MTB, it comes with two interior pockets right here. And there's your handle right here. And then on the side, it also has pockets too. 
same on the other side right here then if we open it up i got some pillows right here just to fill it up and then on the inside you got pockets right here and then another pocket is right here on the other side and then that's where the shoulder strap is so this is exactly what i mean that i wish the rucksack came with this uh padding right here would have been nice and then there is no interior pockets over here just the front and back and as you can tell it's not stiff it is very soft for a twill and again this is when Philson was experimenting with navy and this is when the navy twill was very supple instead of stiff like you're normally accustomed to seeing with Philson and so that is the medium travel bag in navy we have more and then this is the duffel bag the medium duffel bag now when i first saw the medium duffel bag it was actually bigger than this i guess they made the duffel bag much more smaller but in the camera it shows very light but it's actually dark brown in person and how do you know this is the medium because of this not only that i got this on sale which is pretty good on nordstrom rack uh 395 to 170 which is pretty good no pockets right here just your regular flap and again this is actually smaller than the original medium travel travel uh, medium duffel bag because when i first saw the medium duffel bag it was bigger than this that's for sure so i just filled this up with whatever i can fill it with some pants right there and then some market bags apollos market bags and then just paper now with this it comes with a pocket right here on the side hopefully you can see that pocket right here and that's where i put my shoulder strap there's no front or back pocket like the medium tra uh, travel bag and here's the other side pocket right here and i mean that is it for the duffel bag as you can tell now if you're gonna buy a duffel bag i do recommend the medium especially for traveling or even a weekend this is definitely the best all-arounder in terms of size so again i apologize if that's too light well hopefully that's much better because this is an actual the actual color of the medium duffel bag and the brown color duffel bag and so let's move on to the next uh, bag so moving on to the next bag is the filson pullman has the d-rings right here for the shoulder straps exterior pockets right here and that's where the, I keep the shoulder strap right here as you can see well, you can see that and then on the other side is the zippered pocket right here great for magazines and also your ticket and the way this open is basically again this is your carry handle right here it is the clamshell design I just fill it up with whatever now this is good for a uh, a week's worth of items it has the cinch straps right here just fill it up with some pillows as you can tell it's just one big huge compartment no hidden pockets no nothing it's just simple cinch cinch straps on both sides it's pretty good and this can be flattened when storing which is pretty good so this is what it looks like when flattened as you can tell not much pretty good now if i was gonna get a pullman certainly the tan looks good and when this is full especially if you put heavy items this can't this tend to be really heavy even just now you can i can feel the heft too with this bag and so let's get to the last and final bag i just recently bought this is the briefcase i finally decided to get the briefcase after so long and i got this on sale at nordstrom i had them price match it 
got it for a really really good price $170 new so this is the flap right here this is your opening and then that's where I keep my uh, shoulder strap it has pockets right here see some pen pockets right there as you can see you put your pens your cards whatever and then your laptop or even magazine or even papers whatever documents papers whatever you want to put in there again I just got this so this is pretty new to me because I decided to get it because I mean sooner or later I'm probably gonna need one just because and so this is my uh, maybe my last Pilsen bag we'll see my last Pilsen item and so that basically concludes this video of my Pilsen collection if you have any questions below let me know and I will try to answer them and hopefully you enjoyed this video and again I will see you on the next video this is Mr. Informal signing out bye bye